Hi everyone, this is Father Daiju Kuriakos from Vancouver, Canada. As we have just started the season of Lent, I wish all of you a blessed Lenten season. Today we are going to do a small reflection on the Gospel of John, chapter 14, verses 1 to 6. We know that our Lord Jesus Christ has died at the cross to save us. What happened to Jesus after his death? Is he still dead? Of course not. He rose again from his death. Where is he now? He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of the Father. Towards the end of his earthly life, Jesus knew what was going to happen to him. So he called his disciples and told them he was going to suffer and die at the cross. When they heard it, they were very sad and afraid. So he consoles them saying that they are going to reunite in his father's house one day. He said, there are so many rooms in my father's house. When he prepares place for them, he will come back and take them there so that they will be with them forever. Or in other words, Jesus was telling them that they are not going to live in this world forever. Instead, they will pass from this life and enter into their eternal life in heaven. Now, how do we get there? Is heaven guaranteed to everyone? Do you want to go heaven? Without the Lord, we can't. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth and life. Or in other words, Jesus is the gate through which we can enter into our eternal home, that's heaven. So what can we do in order to enter into heaven? Trust the Lord Jesus Christ. Accept him as our Savior and Lord. Connect our life with him in prayer. Then he will give us the grace to lead a good and worthy life that will ensure our eternal life. So it is a beautiful promise for us that eventually we will be united with our Creator in heaven. Dear friends, with that hope, let, let us observe the season of Lent for spiritual renewal and a good life. God bless you.